Join up with the winning court and the 13 hurling manager, Michal Nocton. And Michal, you'd be very happy how that turned out. Very happy, very awful awesome, tough game. Um, we never really played Hatsford before. Um, didn't, didn't know what we were coming up against. Um, I rang around a few clubs in and said they were a tough, tough team. But they were a tough team. It was a tough, tough match. Um, wasn't a very free moving match. But uh, they took deep in it and they got the scores. Um, I think only for the free taking was a little bit better on our side than theirs. Um, but I have to hand it out to two teams that it was a really tough, um, hard, hard game. We love hard games in it. I think Hatsker loves hard games too, you know. And you knew you were going to be in a hard game very from the start, even though you'd opened up the score into a Hasker phone over straight down for a goal. As you said, to a lot of chances in the match. Indeed, um, uh, at the very, very start, we knew it was from the throw in, um, it was just the tackles went off at her. Went off at her, then the referees, a lot of frees. Um, but it was, just, it was that tight, but it was just so even of, t- of the two teams together, you know, very even. And I think on the age side as well, I can split down the middle of both teams, um, just couldn't pull them apart. It was just a few scores we got that, that sealed it, you know. Uh, you mentioned there too, now at half time it was 1 2 apiece, but you're going against the win, so taking chances were important. And Dylan Murphy, the serving man of the match, he didn't let you down with the freeze. Yeah, he was captain as well. Like, um, we brought them in, um, we knew they weren't playing well. They weren't playing well, um, they could play a lot better than they could. Um, they kind of let them in, in on us, but um, we brought them into half time. Connor Dunn, our coach, well experienced man, ex guy player, uh, had a good choice towards them. They came out fighting. Um, I think Dylan did a captain's part in it at the end there. Cleared an awful lot of ball there to save the day. Um, but I think we just held out, just held out as we've seen over teeth, you know. And of course, this is A1, it's up near the elite of Galway Hurling. Very, very important for these players. It'll give them great confidence too to continue the proud tradition of Gort Hurling Club. Yeah, it's tough. A1, A1, A1 is even tougher, but A1 is it's off competitive. Um, the teams, there's nothing much between all the teams up there. Um, it's fiercely competitive. Um, I know all the games we had, there's only two scores, and we're missing players and gone holidays and injuries. Um, but there's very little between. I was talking to other managers now as well, and um, same thing. Very little in all of us there, up, up around A1. And I suppose A&O be more of a elite group, but um, we're happy, we're happy, we're happy we're all done, you know, what we achieved. And rightfully so, be happy you're a county winning manager, Michal. I see the celebration in the background. Let's get back to us. Thank you very much for talking to us. Thank you very much, cheers. Thank you.